Good freaking afternoon, everybody. Now, my name is Gabe, aka Gibson. Now, for those of you who don't know, I do camping videos. And I used to do fish tank videos with uh, all my aquariums and breeding fish and whatnot. And I used to get into it. But, yeah, if you want to check those out, I mean, I'd advise not to just because that was when I was beginning YouTube. And, you know, they're not the best videos. Even though my own videos now aren't the best, but they're better than what... Yeah, anyway, who cares? Now, I've got an idea. Now, those of you who wanted to see me doing the 50% water change and wanted the update update sorry of the fish tank because I haven't shown you guys in for so long which um, actually nobody asked me but who cares you're getting a video now here is my six foot fish tank now I've got an idea of doing a 50% water change which I usually do every two weeks should be every week but um, yeah I've got this brilliant idea of getting the rocks out doing the 50% water change and me hopping inside of there and waiting for Taylor to come home and get a reaction of me swimming in the fish tank. Now, for the <laughs> sounds stupid, but I'm just so keen. I've always wanted to do it since I've got this tank. It was just, you know, t you know, the fish tank is six foot and I'm only like five foot eight, maybe nine. So technically I can lay down in the fish tank. So basically what I'm gonna do is show you guys obviously how I actually do it. Like turn off the filters, how I drain the tank, and um, yeah, just how I just maintain the tank. But then there's gonna be a slight twist to it. I'm gonna put the camera hidden down. I actually got my studio light out, so it might be a bit sus, but I've let her know this morning I will be doing 50% water change, so she will know to come home to me working on the fish tank. But little does she know I am gonna be laying down in there with goggles on that I've lost somewhere. Here you go. And I'm going to be snorkeling with my fish. What I'll actually do first is take the lids off, take all the food off. The lids are off and that's what it looks like. Without any lids, you can see straight down. Now, some of you are saying, dude, that is so disgusting. Why would you get in that water? I just did a major, like, clean. I'm talking about taking rocks, yeah, everything. New water, new filter like cleaned out the filter and whatnot and that was only a couple of days ago so this doesn't even smell um but you gotta regularly do 50% water changes to keep it so clear so it's currently draining waiting game now actually i'm gonna turn off the heaters and the filters and that four cupboards now this is the chaos one this is where basically what runs the whole entire fish tank so a bunch of wires and whatnot that's the big filter I've got, big canister filter. Keeps it clean, it does the job. Um, got my pump here, obviously on cloth. For those of you who do, you have fish tanks and that, you'll know what, why I do that. It's just to prevent it from rattling around, but oh well. Yeah, back here is the board. I've just got to figure out which one is the filter and the heater that is back there, that big silver thing. I'll be running, I'll leave the bubbles in there. And then once the tank gets to about halfway, um, take the rocks out, and then I have to test it because obviously when I get into there, because I'm such a big bodybuilder and I've got so much weight on me, once I do get in there, the water is gonna rise. That's just scientific facts, but. So let's test this one. That is the bubbles, turn that one back on. Well, that's hard to do with one hand. Let's just put it here. So this one here is... That's the heater and then pump. Done. I'll leave the light on and the bubbles going. Shut this and nobody would know. Alright, so now put the camera down and we'll wait till that gets to 50%. I'm going to grab a towel to chuck all the rocks on. Or I might just chuck them straight outside. We don't need a towel on the floor anyway. <laughs> but yeah, alright, let's get into it. There you have it, all the rocks. Alright, I've left this big one here and a couple of little ones just because I do have sucker fish and a few of these fish I do own that do like to hide so I don't want to scare him too much obviously I don't want to harm him and my fish during this stunt but 
yeah, so I've just left that one and it's a big heavy one as well, so I don't want to lift it out. But I'm going to dry it a little bit more, then I'll probably hop in. Um, I'll be messaging Taylor, she's still well, about 30 minutes away, so I still have a bit of time. So, um, yeah, and I'll jump in, test it, see how high the water does come. Because I do want, for when I do get in, I do want the water to be back to where it was, or at least somewhere I don't want it to look heaps empty or overflow, if you know what I mean. So, I've got to do a test kind of thing. Other than that, all going well. I don't know, I'm kind of shaking right now. It's, she's actually coming home a lot quicker than I thought. So, her dad's going to pick her up now. Oh no, I think her sister is. So, I got my little man here. I'm going to use this ladder to jump in. Or get in slowly. I hope I don't damage the tank. If I do, oh well, I mean, like the video. Because I did go through a lot of effort for this. But yeah, so, I'll get in there. And once I am in there laying down... I'm going to get him to take this ladder out and go hide it. Um, make sure I've got my goggles on. This is going to be the funniest thing ever. I'm, I'm shaking right now because, yeah, I didn't, I didn't even know what was going to go in there if that fish is going to eat me. But I'm in here. I'm going to hide the camera here somewhere. Hopefully, hopefully you see that. Beautiful. Get ready to get rid of this. We got a reaction, I don't know if that's what I wanted, but I'm going to have a look at the footage. Um, but yeah, this video was mainly just for a 50% water change, but then I thought I'd tweak it up. And what do you think? Silly. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think she's um, too happy. She reckons I killed the fish, but look, no fish have been um, They're all alright. Not going to lie, that was pretty scary in there. You could see all the fish and they were swimming all on me. and Yeah, so I'm going <laughs> to finish... Um, Doing the 50% water change, I'm going to drain a little bit more and then I'm going to add more water in. Oh, oh Zara. Oh, bless your cotton little socks. Anyway, I'm going to wrap this up, get it all done. So, I didn't end the video last night because I wanted to wait for the aquarium to settle. So then I can show you the best, I don't know, the best uh, version of it. So yeah, everything's done. Put the water back in. I've built a new reef. And I think it looks awesome, so... So there you have it. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, join the family. Now, I went through the effort for that, so please just smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Till next time.